controversy, John Harbaugh? There will be no quarterback controversy in our locker room. Our guys want to win. They know all three guys can win. And whatever way we decide to go, it's only going to be to make our team as the, the strongest it can be. You know, maybe we play them all three. Maybe we play one of them. I mean, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out, you know. Um, but as we said, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Maybe we'll play all three. Maybe we'll play one of them. Which one of them should they play, David Carr, if Flacco is healthy enough to go back in? It's, it's a good question. I can see why John's having a hard time figuring it out because you can't take Lamar off the field. I think that he's played well enough and he's given enough to your run game to where he's, a, he's definitely a, a guy that you could use going forward, especially with the, we think about it, what is one over the past you know, two, three decades in the NFL. You have to be able to, at least when the weather changes and you start playing these playoff football games, you gotta be able to run the football and you have to play good defense. Well, the Ravens have played pretty good defense this year, albeit defense hasn't really been played in the NFL, So, but they've done the best job, I think, consistently. And then if you couple that with a good run game, you have to keep that element. So whether Flacco gets healthy and he comes back and he plays a little bit, Lamar Jackson must be on the field because even when people know that he's going to run the football, like they, they clearly know the last couple weeks that he's not going to be a guy that's going to push the ball down the field, throw it 30 or 40 times a game, but yet they still can't stop him. He's still able to run the football. They're still able to run for over 200 yards a game. So that has to be, there's something to be said for that. If you're John Harbaugh, you can't take him off the field completely. Well, and just keeping in mind the other teams that are in the AFC that you will be fighting for in a playoff Correct. race if you're in it, uh, you're not necessarily going to outscore them if Joe Flacco is your exactly. quarterback. It's, so it's, it's a, a ball point. control right. situation, too. Right, if, if too. Flacco is in, they weren't scoring 30 or 40 points a game. So let's think about how we can actually really win this thing and compete with those guys. Let's keep them more in line. Let's slow the game down a little bit and give them less possessions. You know, if you think about playing Kansas City, you're going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Kansas City? L.A. almost couldn't do that. So, I mean, that's something you really got to think about. Uh, from a perspective standpoint, when we're talking about Lamar Jackson as a rusher, two, 265 yards on the ground in his last three starts. That is the most since the merger for a rookie quarterback in his first three starts. Scott. Let's look at some 6-6 six and six football teams that are in.